Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the Elementor video series. In this video, we will see how to use the Elementor AI Builder feature. Recently, Elementor has added the AI Builder feature and let's see how we can use the Elementor AI Builder feature. For example, I have customized the style setting of this image. When I move the cursor, it is changing the border radius. So I have created this code using the Elementor AI. You can see the background color of this section, which is changing continuously and it is using gradient colors. I have created this custom CSS using the Elementor AI. I have also created this title and this product description using the Elementor AI. You can also use the Elementor AI feature to create custom HTML codes such as this scrolling text. So there are many possibilities where you can use the Elementor AI Builder feature. So let's see how does this work. So here I'm logged into the dashboard of the WordPress website and we are using Elementor on this website. Here you will see the basic Elementor plugin and I'm also using Elementor Pro plugin on this website. Let me go to the website. This is an e-commerce website that I have designed using the WordPress, WooCommerce and Elementor plugin. I do have a full video course on how to design e-commerce website using WooCommerce and Elementor plugin. It is more than eight hours long YouTube video tutorial. If you want to watch this video, I'll give you the link in the description box. Now let's go to the website and let's see how we can use the Elementor AI Builder feature. So we are on this homepage. Let's go to edit with Elementor. Now you will see this kind of screen create smarter with Elementor AI. If you want to learn more, you can click on learn more. It will open the documentation. Some AI features are available for the basic element of free plugin and some AI builder features are available for the pro version of this plugin. For example, you can see it here. You can generate text with the basic free element of plugin, create code in the HTML widget that is also available for the basic element of free plugin. And these two options are available for the Pro users that is that means the element of pro plugin user so here I'm on the demo page and here you can see an image a title some description and a button now let's say I want to change the background color of this section so you can go to this section you can select the section this is the layout of the section you can go to advanced and at the bottom you will see custom CSS so here you can use the element of AI to write the custom CSS for you here you will see the option code with AI Click on it. Now here you can see it will, it will give you some prompts or you can write in your own prompt here. See here it shows a rainbow colored animated text or let's say gradient background. We need to change the background color. So I'm going to use the gradient, the gradient background. Generate code. So this is the code that has been generated. You can click on insert and it's going to use this code. So it's going to change the color automatically. Now let's go to this image and we can use the custom CSS for the image also. Here you will see choose image and there is an Elementor AI which is coming soon which will generate images for you. As of now this is not available. Let's go to advanced, go to custom CSS and click on code with AI. Now here you will see some prompts. Let's use this one. Add a circle shape, clip mask, semi transparent on hover, generate code. So if you don't know how to write the CSS codes, you can simply use the Elementor AI. Now, if I move the cursor, you will see the effect here. If you do not want it, you can simply delete this one and use a new one. So what I have written here is change the border radius of this image from 0 to 25% on hover, change the image size to 120% on hover and change the overlay color to transparent black on hover. Let's generate the code, insert it. Now let's move the cursor and you will see the border radius is around 25%. Let's change it to 50%. You will see the option here. You will see the code here. You can simply change it to 50% here. And I want to change the size is 1.2. Let's change it to smaller one. Let's make it 0 0.9. So it will be 90%. And this is how it will look. 
and we need to add some smooth transition there All right let's delete this one and create a new one so this is the new prompt change the border radius from 0 to 50 percent on hover rotate the image 360 degree on hover add overlay black color with opacity 50 percent and use smooth transition All right let's generate the code here let's insert it and you will see the rotation here and the transition is there if you do not want any one of them you can simply select this one let's see i do not want to rotate it so i'm going to delete this one and you will see the transition just like this now let's go to title for the text or the title you will see this option write with ai if you want to write content you can use this one let's see suggest a title for new jacket generate text so this will be the title you can see the title here use this text and you will see the text added here if you want to change the color of this one you can again use the custom css insert it and you will see the changing style setting for the title all right let's delete this one change the color now here we have the text box and i want to write something for the jacket product write product description for jacket generate text so this is the text introducing our sleek stylish jacket design to keep your keep you warm so if you want to change the tone you can change the tone here casual conference formal friendly inspirational so it's going to create content according to the tone that you set translate to so if you want to change this to another language you can use these options here so i'm going to use this text now you can customize the button settings you can go to the custom CSS and from here you can change the custom CSS for the button. You will get some props here. All right, now, now here you might have noticed upgrade option. If you want unlimited access to Elementor AI, you can, you can upgrade the plan. If I click on it, it will give me the pricing. It will show you the pricing. It is $2.99 per month and it will be built annually. You will get generate text and modified tone, fixed spelling and grammar length, translate into any language, write custom CSS, generate custom code, add HTML anywhere. So this is these are the paid services. Let's go to the next one. I want to add, let's say HTML code here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to add, I'm going to search for HTML. Just drag it and drop it here. And here you can use the HTML code iframe code to embed the shopify widget if you have shopify widget you can embed the shopify widget so this is the code that is generated i'm going to use it and you will see the scrolling text as i requested so there are many sections where you can use the Elementor AI Builder feature and you can customize the style settings of any section on your website. So that's it for now. See you in the next video. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comments section and press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching Quick Tips.